Question number three, Angus MacDonald. To ask the Scottish Government how many breaches of the sulphur dioxide 15-minute mean objective as specified in the Air Quality Scotland Regulations 2000 have taken place since the Grangemouth Air Quality Management Area was declared in November 2005. Stuart Stevenson. Between November 2005 and February 2012, there were 761 exceedances of this objective recorded across the three air quality monitoring sites in Grangemouth. A three-year INEOS-led project is expected to reduce sulphur dioxide emissions by over 80% by the end of the current year. Angus MacDonald. I thank, thank the Minister for his reply. I am sure he will agree with me that any exceedance of the SO2 15-minute mean objective is one breach too many, and 761 is far in excess of that. While local Grangemouth industry has made some attempt to reduce the number of exceedances, does the Minister share with me the concerns of local residents that a proposed 100 megawatt biomass electricity plant could have a detrimental effect on the air quality in Grangemouth, particularly when the cumulative effect from Longanit and other industrial plants in the area are taken into account? Minister. Um, well, I won't uh, comment uh, because of the role that Scottish Ministers may have in making planning decisions on any specific proposal, uh, but I will make the obvious observation uh, that what the member has said is a, is a very important matter that should be brought uh, forward uh, to decision makers so that it can be taken account of so that a proper decision is made in due course.